A father of five is desperate to stay in the U.S. after ICE ordered him to be deported to Mexico. His five-year-old son is battling leukemia, and he's the only parent who can administer the boy's medication, which can be toxic. My wife cannot give him the pills because she's pregnant. Jesus Baroness says he was brought to the U.S. from Mexico in 1989 when he was one. Since then, he's married a U.S. citizen, had children, and has been providing for his family. He says he was once caught driving without a license and was deported twice, crossing back into the U.S. illegally. To avoid deportation this time, he's taken refuge in a local church. His wife is terrified of what could happen if ICE obtains a warrant to arrest him. His kids need him. I need him. It's going to be hard. Baroness says ICE denied his last request to stay, and he would have to leave the U.S. for 10 years before he could apply to come back. But his church community supports him and is praying for a miracle. He shouldn't be prosecuted. He should be lifted up, used as an example of what it means to be a father. Baroness's attorney says he is still waiting to hear from ICE, but this father says he won't leave willingly. I will fight to stay here. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Mara Montalbano.